Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part four. Let's play Magical Mirror starring Mickey Mouse. Alright, let's see if there's anything in this pot of plant. Anything? Nothing. Alright, before we go upstairs, we already got what? How many pieces of the mirror? Was it eight? I mean, I could probably just look in the menu and find out. But I think it is around eight. Let's try this room. Okay, there's some stars over there, I can see. Let me go grab it. I see a bunch of chairs. I see drums. Bongos. A piano. Can I play the piano? Nope, the piano plays itself. Maybe I should sit down. Okay, maybe I won't sit down. How about the guitar? Gee, watch this. Four? That's a very expensive trick. I guess you don't really need a musician. You can do it yourself. This is amazing. <laughs> Mickey the Guitar Master. <laughs> Move the pick left and right to catch the stars that are coming down. If you press A when you catch a spinning star, then you'll get a special point. One, two, three, four. Oh, that's what this is. Okay, there's no stars. Oh, there's one. Oh, you have to hold the button. I thought you just had to tap it. Feel about this. So remember, if it's spinning, hit A. Oh god, this is so awkward. What score do I need to succeed at this? Do I even need to play this game? Oh, but it was worth it because it was like, what? So many stars. These are color coded too. I mean, the moving background does not help. It's so distracting. Boo, you suck! Four misses? Wow, only four misses? And I got the max bonus! Damn! I could have swore I would only got like maybe 10 out of 12. Not 12 out of 12, that's beautiful. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it never happened, Mickey. Mm -hmm. It was all a figment of your imagination. Did I ever go through this room? Oh, no. Obviously not. I need a key. Okay. I guess we'll just head on out. Go the other way. Okay. I'm surprised there are still keys I need to find. I thought I would have unlocked a lot of the doors. So I guess we are going upstairs after all. So yeah, we making things happen. Learn how to play the guitar. I am passive with fish. I found a floating windmill. Don Quixote, eat your heart out. Gotcha. And that's it. Is there anything in here? Oh, it's a ghost! Tiny! Look, what are you gonna do? This is small. <laughs> uh, 
Hit with a flashlight. <coughs> I couldn't reach the mic in time. Sorry. Sorry you had to hear that. I guess I don't have the item for it yet. Maybe it's in here? Is that an item, or is that just a lamp? It, like, it looks like a bird cage. Can't do anything with that either. Alright. Guess we're done in here. Uh, was, which door is this door? I just have to look at the perspective again. I uh, guess we'll just head back. Because we need to find a key. Back this way, I guess? No. I would think so. I probably have to go back to the TV. Which door again? Oh. Yeah, it's this one. I'm just remembering now. No, no, not, not that one. It's this one. And go back through here. Don't go through the blue door. We don't want to go all the way back. Let me look through the holes again. Hmm? Says I need an item. And come to think of it, a marble can probably fit through that hole. Hmm. Let's try the marble. Why does I gotta do that every time? Something's happening. Aha! So you need the marble to drop it on the X, and then you'll get a star container. <laughs> I guess if I dropped it through the wrong hole, I would just get the marble again. Or it just wouldn't let me do it. Okay. I'd say it just wouldn't let me do it. All right, that brings our max to eight. <laughs> you can just look at it right there. Okay. Like, what are these stars in the corner? What do they do? You know what I haven't found in a while? One of those coins. Where am I gonna find another coin? Maybe I missed a coin somewhere? In a previous room? I'm pretty sure that's not a coin. I think that's just a star. Alright, seems so though I'm here. Whoa, wait a minute. This wasn't here before. Gotcha. Oh, it's making a mini in a photo. That cute. Alright, I guess we're done here. I was gonna try that trick again where Mickey sits where it happens when Mickey sits down. But you have to you have to get it just before you blink. Why did they have to make that one so fast? I guess I'll just have to retrace my steps. Let's see where I might have found a missing coin. the hell? I can look at that now. Wow. Oh god, the eyes moved. Hmm. Now what? Hmm. hmm. That's very sus. Hmm? Oh. 
sweating. Oh, get nervous. Get nervous. I could have swore that ghost was scared of me. Now you're still up to your old tricks. I'm starting to think this ghost wants me to find the mirror. Like, why would it just, like, try to s sneak by me holding one of the shards? It's pretty suspicious. Take a sip of my coffee there, it's still pretty hot. Yeah, I'm pretty much just mass recording this, trying to finish this all in one sitting. Depending on how long it is. Because remember, like I said in the first video, I had to move my entertainment center really close to the coffee table just to be able to play this game. So, I'm thinking, like, once I get this done, I can move it all back. Grab that wall over here. Okay, maybe I really should retrace my steps a little better. Let me head back in here. Before I go to the piggy bank. Cause wasn't there a trick I was able to do at the time? And I think I gotta do this by the shadow. Like right now! Aha! The ghost was here! Oh my god, I almost missed it! Hey, birds itself! Hmm. <laughs> oh my god, the coin was right there! So, I missed that trick a couple times, and I could have gotten the coin sooner. Alright, I guess I'll just leave. <laughs> Door. That's what I wanted you to do, man. Okay. Okay, let's go back to the piggy bank. Now that we got our third coin. Man, I could have gotten that a while ago. Oh well. Better late than never, I guess. Look at the size of that gear. I might be able to get it if I just pop one more coin in there. Hot Tom. <laughs> Usually three is the magic number for MacGuffins. Oh my god, it's squealing! Oh, I did not feel good about doing that. Why the piggy bank had to make a death squeal? No. Oh. Why? No. Are you trying to make me uncomfortable? <laughs> well, now that I got the remote, maybe I should try to turn on the TV. Maybe it's one of those TVs that requires the remote. And I've seen a few of those back in the day. Like, even if you press the button, Gee, it wouldn't be enough. Alright, well, I don't have to do that trick mm -hmm. again. Go. Well, luckily, I don't even need to worry about it. Because the shadow is still back to normal. Mm -hmm. 
Why do I have to watch that every single time? And you can't skip it, remember? You can't even press pause. Mm -hmm. Like, normally you can't skip cutscenes, but you can pause them. This time you can't even pause. Oh boy, we finally get to watch TV! Watch how we've been here so long, all that's hmm. on is just damn infomercials. Look! Oh boy! I've seen this George Foreman grill advertisement many times already! Oh -ho! Oh, oh, this doesn't get wow. me DMCA'd. <laughs> no! No! Oh god, no! <laughs> this is an actual cartoon! Oh, this is probably gonna get me in trouble. Uh, might have to edit that one out. No. Okay, okay, we're on to something new. Now it's food. I needed to play a trick on food. Oh, TV makes me sleepy. Do you have like narcolepsy or something? Every time you sit down, you get tired. Oh my. <laughs> dance with Mickey. Watch Mickey's dance moves very carefully. Dance to the rhythm with the A button and the control stick. Oh, here's an example. Okay, that seems easy to remember. I was hitting right. Why didn't it register? Oh, great. Now it's left A, right A. I don't need to watch the example every time. I know how to play now. Perfect. That one is flawless. Oh god, now it's all inputs. Did you get to see your inputs? Beautiful. So I had a few misses on round one, but then the rest of them was immaculate. Okay, that's it. I only did that just to play mini game for bonuses. Well, I needed to max out my stars again, so I can't complain. Wake up. Wake up! What? Well, I can't believe there was like scenes of an actual cartoon. Was it an actual cartoon? I might have to look into that. Or it might have been something specific to the game and not revealed anywhere else. Uh, 
I don't want the Disney lords to go after me. You don't want that to happen, do you? And then some people are like, Well, you did play a ROM hack with save states, so I would be happy if everything in your channel got shut down. I don't think anyone would actually say that. But still. <laughs> there might be at least one or two people thinking it. All right, I gotta think for a sec. Where the frick do I go now? Okay. I think because I have that gear, I can go back to the clock tower. Which, if I remember correctly, was beyond this way. I think? Yeah, I think it might have been down here. And all that jazz. Yeah, I'm starting to remember. I think it was on the other side of the cave. And there was like a lever that I could not activate. Because maybe I needed a gear? Which thankfully we just got from the piggy bank. Alright, looks like it's all coming together now. That secret passage should still be open, right? It's not? Oh, I had to inspect the painting again. Why do you even bother to go back? Doesn't make any sense. A part of me is wondering, like, why Mickey can't just, like, dash. But it is a cave. It'd be pretty easy to fall and get hurt. So at least they're thinking that through. You gotta have some element of realism in a Mickey Mouse game, I guess. Okay. Okay, let's take a look at those gears. Maybe there's something I can do with them now. Now that I actually have a gear. Or maybe it's gotta be the small ones. Gee, watch this. Ooh, something is missing. I wonder if I gotta put the thing that came from my piggy bank. Now why the ghost decided to put that in the piggy bank, I have no idea. Here. It gets its own fanfare. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, fit it in there, Mickey. I like it like that. Wow. Why is that there? What did they all sparkle? Got it. Not even the lever is sparkling. I wonder if the game is trying to tell me something here. Hmm. Alright, what if I pull it now? Hmm. You can do it, put hmm. your back into it. I did it. That should get things moving again. Oh, there was a mirror piece right there. Gee, watch this. It's good to know that it's not fragile. Like it's already broken to pieces and it can't shatter into any more than that.
Okay, so that's mirror piece number 10, I believe. How many more pieces are there? It looks like it's 12 in total. Unless that piece on the left is really, like, two shards put together. 12 seems like a more relevant number than 13, though. So maybe there's one or two pieces left. if I click it again? Wait. Oh no! Oh, this looks painful. Ow, ow! Oh. The controller vibrates every time you get hit, too. I think that's what I need to do. <laughs> oh! So this is how I get out? Four o'clock? No, I want to keep tuning it a bit more. You gotta react just to get over there to that minute hand. Maybe I can keep this going until I run out of stars. I don't know if that'd be a great idea, but we can try it. Ah, what the hell, for kicks and giggles. I think a 9 o'clock might be a reasonable number. And I'll just leave it alone. Container too. Oh, I guess six o'clock was enough. I could have just kept it at six o'clock, and that still would have worked. So I wasted some stars. Then again, if I get that container, I'll grab it anyway. Oh boy, what do I do now? Oh, I'm on a roof. I'm scared of heights. What do I do? The rope? I'll grab the rope. You can do it, Mickey. Oh no, I don't have enough stars. I need two stars. Well, I guess I can head back down. You're acting like Jaws is about to chase you. Just go down. It's all right. Oh, he's gonna fall. He's gonna fall. Ah! 
And then he fractured his skull. <laughs> okay. Well, I guess since we're here, we might as well get that star container. Because it looks like I need tricks to get to the bell tower. Yeah! Max Tricky! Let's go! Let's freaking go! Alright, so I gotta go all the way back to the lever, unfortunately. That's the bad news. The good news is I probably only had to do it once. So I don't have to use up all my stars on the cuckoo. On the cuckoo. I know I gotta use a trick to get up here in the first place. That's fine. I can use up one. And then I'm not gonna do any more than that. Unfortunately, we have to watch the entire thing. For reasons. Because this game doesn't pace itself that well. <laughs> I guess I can just leave it as is. I don't have to do any tricks. It's gonna be 3 o'clock anyway. I think I'll just save my stars for the rope. And everything's hunky dory. Let's go. So we gotta try this again. This time we have more than enough stars. This is really high up in the air. A lot of the buildings have the same color roofs. What's up with that? Was this mandated by law or something? Just go, you coward. You can do it. I'm scared. Alright, I'll do a trick to make me brave. I guess I can use that for balance. Oh, gosh. This is nerve wracking. I wonder if I gotta do any inputs to survive. Come on, Mickey. You can do it. I guess he did it. Oh, there's no mini game. It's just you did it. Oh, hello. There was something in the bell. Gotcha. I learned from many game, many video games that when it comes to clock towers, check the bell for something. And this was no exception. I guess we can go in here. Oh, okay. hello. I see you there. Okay. The thing is, I can't reach you. Hmm. Well, we gotta come up with something. Hmm? And we don't have it. Maybe it's down here. Could there be something to help us reach? Like a long stick. Couldn't we just use that long stick that we used to go across the rope and just knock the mirror piece down? 
Like, why didn't we just bother to do that? What the hell? This looks like some kind of dungeon. Gotcha. Well, that's a uh, pretty much a diorama of the castle itself. I'll go grab some stars. Okay. Okay, we good. I don't see anything. Okay. Oh god, there's a mini game? Alright, let me just hit A real fast. He's gonna charge right into the wall, isn't he? This is this is so camp. Like this is so weird. A lot of this is just Matrix stuff rather than Disney. Like what is the premise of this? Well, whatever the case, that's the eleventh piece. Oh my god, almost everything we've been picking up is ending up in the room. Okay, one more piece, I think. And then we got it completed. Again, I like to reiterate, this point-and-click game is more for PC than GameCube. I mean, not that this is a terrible game, I just think it doesn't fit the console it's on. That's all I'm gonna say. Okay, well, I guess we'll just go back to the dungeon. And I think this would be a good time to save and end the episode. Alright, so next part, we'll go explore this area, which has green lighting for some reason. And hopefully be on our way to completing the mirror. See everyone, thanks for watching.